by whether you were here yet today or not. This is English. Sorry? This is today. See, that's not even held. You get rid of all those browsers. See, the set wall penetration zone sort of grown up to that bottom. Well, it's only here, isn't it? Yeah. I can't see that. Bam. So we've removed the tile from the wall, and you can see the water ingress, and I mean it stinks. The water penetration is, we're going to have to cut this open because behind this stack you'll see shortly is water sitting on the ground. It is actually nothing supporting the cabinet here. This whole wall's gone. Um, You'll see up here we've removed the grout. We'll just have to get a level on here and see how far it's been pushed out. We may have to remove this tile and this tile at the moment, but we'll just get a level and a straight edge and see how far we're out on these. But I believe we can actually cut this off, make a frame and then start again. Anyway, we'll get back to you shortly. So what we can tell is that's the vanity that's the tile under the vanity, that's the maintenance hatch. That is rotten to here, so we're going to remove everything downwards. The other thing is, when they've built this, the tile is below the bedding sand, so now we have to dig out all the tile along the bottom. And the best way to show you this is, this is how deep it is. I've got a monitor this. So this is the depth of it when we pull it out. So you'll see this is the incorrect way to build the bedding. It, it's, we've got to fix this now. We'll get back to you shortly. And the stink, oh my God. So this door has split all the way up. What we're going to try to attempt to do is glue it and re-staple it. We'll let you know how we go in a minute. She's all the same. If you want to grab your glue, I'll find this here. Where are we going to start? Let's glue it in there. Just keep on going down here. Just to there. Nothing below here. Yep. One more you're in. One more. Just load it up, mate. And now just go up every couple of centimetres. I think that sealed it. You put one there. No, you can. Yep. One above it. If you have a look here, the door's not not quite pulling up. No, that's what I'm saying. Put plenty in them. That's it. Wood is coming out. The counter's sinking, aren't they? 
Nice. That should be a hammer, isn't it? Can't even see the crack now. Look at that. Yeah. Got that for a ninety-nine dollar fucking break, one, isn't it? So we're just doing some basic room maintenance at the moment. We've come into one of the rooms and found a hole in the wall, and we're just going to replaster this at the moment. Back at you later. Yeah. Give me a few big ones. We'll get the clock and get on with it. That'll do. Not overdo it. Come, mate. I'm going to take that one and just come out of the side of the mirror. There's one there. Just need that sander, mate. Yep. So at the moment we've pulled the ceiling down in here because of the water ingress and we're now going to attempt to try to repair this one the best we can. We do know where the water is leaking. It is leaking up here around this pipe. You'll see moisture and driplet droplets. So this is our problem area. We're going to try to put a puddle flange around this to capture the water. But at the moment it's still leaking. So we can't see any water damage further in the building. You'll see the water line up here. So we're going to lift all these electrical and put them into place properly. Get them out of the water. And we'll get back to you once we finish with the new ceiling. But yep, we've got to fix all this. This down even further. Yep. Right? Round. Mm -hmm. Cut this down. Because we've only got to get the pipe in there a little bit. Yep. Um, can we cut that bottom one down? Or no, because that's set. That's set that. yep. But what I'm thinking of is cutting that down. Cutting that down firstly. Yep. Is that piece cut that out? Yep. And that should fit hopefully inside there, see? Yep. Hopefully. Yep. Yep. Right. And that's why I said if we can cut that out. And then make, because we've got marks in here, we can put four spaces. Because if we sit that flush in there, we're not going to have enough room. No. Right? The next one will come down like this. It was too big. Yeah. Yeah. Right? 
but we've got to sit this tray in there, then run some timber across and sit it on a couple of timber battens. Yep. But we've got to get it higher than that to start with. Yeah. Yep. Right. I'll see how much I can reduce that down. So, guys, you're going to have to reduce it down a fucking lot, mate. Yeah.